what's up guys today we're doing the main character units only challenge 2.0 because we got a lot of new main character units so let's go take a quick peek of how far we got last time we got wave 97 so that's our goal to beat for today's video let's get it popping now the one problem is compared to that video we did get a new money unit so we can no longer use jeff because idol is actually the main character and um uh, speed wagon isn't so uh this might make the challenge a little more interesting. All right, let's get it started. We need our money unit because <laughs> we need as much money as we can. <laughs> let's just say this is a pretty expensive endeavor here. So uh, let's get our money unit placed down and let's go. All right, we're going to start off by uh, upgrading our money unit a little bit more than normal. The reason being is these guys only do like 41 damage. So it's kind of like nothing. <laughs> you know, we don't really have to worry about it too much. So let's get these upgrades as much as we can every time the wave skips and we'll just start tanking a little bit of damage until we can afford our first units so let's do it all right now that's now so let's go use tondro first all right reason we're using tondro is he's a nice fully unit with a decently fast spa uh, meaning we pretty much don't have to worry about anybody like getting past him and so we should be pretty much chilling and we're also going to place another tondro in the back all right just so we don't have to worry about these guys who are going to you know kind of try to sneak through and we should be pretty much good to go so uh, we're going to get um, uh, the powerful upgrade on this guy so we don't have to worry about it. And uh, now we're going to be chilling. All right, let's go max out our girl and I'll see you guys in a second. All right, here we go. We just need the last upgrade on our girl and we should be ready to go. There we go. Bang. All right, now we're probably not going to ever buy this upgrade. It's a little bit too expensive and you lose her buff. So uh, this, this just sucks. I'm not going to lie. All right, anyways, let's go uh, move our Tanjiro down a bit. All right, so we can check out his other upgrades. So he's going to start off with a bunch of damage upgrades, which is pretty sick. And then we got Downward Solar Slash. Now, the nice thing about this one is it actually makes his AoE bigger than before. So if you you can actually just put him on closest. And then that literally is effectively just like having him have the same AoE as before. Because I know a lot of people like full AoE better, but that's, a, that's not a bad way. Again, it won't apply if you have the orbs, but a little trick you can do if you like that full AoE kind of style. All right, all right. Next up, let's get his next upgrade here. Actually, we're gonna upgrade this guy in the back because I don't actually die. All right, here we go. Hybrid. Now he hits the air units, which doesn't really help us, but also I believe increases the damage slightly as well. So he's doing 642. Now, um, sunburn is one of the worst damaging things, but it actually does slow the units by about like 20-ish percent, or it's like 18 percent or something. So like it's actually fairly useful. It's gonna help you get, I believe, at least like one extra wave, um, when you're doing the mode. So not bad. All right, here we go. And then we got um, uh, one more after this. His damage actually gets pretty high. I'm not going to lie. So uh, we got this one. And then we get tr Twin Dragon Fury. Twin Dragon Fury is a very, very nice upgrade. So uh, we're going to get that in a second. We just have to save up for quite a few waves. Because if you take a look, she's doing 130k. Now, um, Tondro buffs that by 20%. So she's giving more like 156 or something like that actually let's see how much she gives let's see if it'll show us wave clear yeah 156k so that's not bad at all but it's just definitely gonna take us quite a while to be able to max everything we want and uh, i'm not sure we're gonna be able to get guts maxed so i'm a little bit worried about that so that that might have been a bad play but i definitely know we can get some good upgrades on the rest of the guys all right here we go let's get it bang twin oh there we go twin dragon fury now the nice thing about this upgrade is it makes him cone aoe again and dang man it's a thick one too guys Oh my gosh, dude. Let's go. He really is the Riz Hashira. All right. Anyways, that's actually a pretty sick attack with the water and the fire. Yeah, and honestly, this this is pretty much going to solo most things. So uh, let's go start saving up a bit of money. Um, but before we do, we are going to go check out our next unit, guys. And that is the one and only Ichigo. All right. Now, this is the original Ichigo Mugetsu from uh, the game. Now, he does have a 7-star version, but that one doesn't slow. So, so this guy's actually, like, better, which is pretty crazy. So, we're just going to put this guy on last real quick. There we go. And he has a few upgrades, but you're going to notice that the upgrades are really mid. Like, bro, who cares about 5,000 damage? So, the only thing that really helps out with this guy is his last upgrade that turns him into a slow unit that hits airs. Now, unfortunately, his SBA is kind of is kind of lame, so uh, it's not going to be the most ideal. But uh, it is what it is. So we're going to try to get the best placements possible. All right. Just to make sure nothing gets through, which is going to definitely be on the more difficult side. So we'll just try to slide this guy in. There we go. Should be good. 
Yeah, yeah, that's not terrible, but it's not great. All right, and then we'll try to slide another guy in over here. Get everything nice and good. Done on last. There we go. We should be chilling. All right, here we go. So uh, let's keep setting up these Ichigos. I think, uh, I don't know if we have them quite perfect, but they're pretty dang close. All right, we'll put them on last. Oh man, that, that actually got, got messed up a bit. I think we have to put them farther back. There we go. All right, that's close enough. All right, and then I think we're just gonna slide an extra one back here, just in case anything, you know, slides through. Should have us in a decent position. There we go. And let's see if we have any more. We do have one more. Um, so I think we're just gonna put this guy right here. There we go. We'll just keep him on first to kind of, you know, even things out a little bit. There we go. So we did end up saving up quite a bit of money on wave 49, 3.72 million. So we're going to have to use this money very wisely because we're not going to get a whole lot of it. So I think our best play here is to use our boy Sid. All right. So let's get our dude Sid upgraded here. And uh, we're going to wait a second. Actually, no, we'll just... Uh, mm. Nah, whatever. We'll just get some some upgrades. Hopefully, it's going to be able to hit these units. All right, here we go. So the nice thing about Sid is he is bleed. So you can basically multiply his damage by right about um, uh, five, which is pretty sick. Power Flame, Slime Spikes, even Atomic Guys. All these upgrades are very, very cheap. So he's bringing out a lot of DPS for only $404,000. All right, Flaming Spikes, Vampire Style. And uh, what we really want to get him, though, is his... Um, uh, nuking ability that's going to get us like four or five extra ways which is going to be insane also quick check at our damage guys up to 6.2 billion which is pretty decent so we just need one more wave skip and then we can get this upgrade here all right basically allowing us to do honestly this one isn't that great of an upgrade it's kind of expensive for what it does but uh we're going to need to get it because we need the upgrade afterwards all right and this upgrade is very worth it it's only a million dollars decent damage increase as well as a very very spicy uh, range increase not to mention that his atomic ability actually becomes good. Now, if you don't get this upgrade, the atomic ability sucks. I think it does like only a few million. So you really, really want to get that upgrade. So, and after that, I think it's time for us to get our guts. Because, uh, let's just say, uh, guts. If we can get a max, I believe that's like guaranteed wave 100 plus. Um, uh, or like even his next max upgrade. But that's going to cost us, I think, like a lot of money. So I don't know if we're going to be able to afford that. Not going to lie. So. We're going to do our best, though, and even if we don't get it, eh, it is what it is. <clears throat> All right, also what we can do is set up our Gojo. I don't know if that's necessary yet, though. We'll probably set up Gojo in a little bit. But uh, meanwhile, we're going to save up a few more ways for this guy's next upgrade, and then I think it's time for us to go for Gojo. All right, here we go. Let's get it. And bang. There we go. We got a nice range increase as well. We're doing 9.24 million. We don't even have the buffs rolling. You know what? Speaking of buffs, I think it's time we get it rolling. There we go, guys. 32.3 million. That's crazy damage. Crazy damage. Even Tondro's hitting with 9.4. Dang, man. All right. I think it's time for us to get our Gojos. We're just going to get all the six Gojos is required here. And then the other ones we're just going to manually time stop with. So it's going to be a little bit annoying to do that, but it is what it is. All right. Now we probably could have bring Jotaro here as well, but uh, I personally like um, uh, Gojo better than Jotaro. I don't know why, but I do. I think it's a slightly longer time stop, which is nice. The only problem with him is he has a lot more upgrades. So he's kind of annoying to use. Unlike Jotaro where he has like two upgrades. And so he's really easy to spam, but that's fine. All right. looks like we're still like instantly killing everybody. So we can't really set up our Gojos right now, which is fine. All right. So we use, we have plenty of money now. So I think we're going to go get our guts ready to go. All right. Now guts, uh, he kind of starts off kind of mid. <laughs> that's the problem. He doesn't have like any bleed or anything. So it's going to take us quite a while for him to do decent damage. But I mean, honestly though, 15.2 million for five is still not bad. Um, but for his price, it's actually not even bad. So I guess I can't really complain. <laughs> it's actually like, you know, even with, I guess even without being max, he's still bringing in, putting in the work. But I do believe his AOE is a little bit small. So that's going to be a little bit annoying. But he's definitely doing a, a good enough amount of damage to be part of the team. All right, here we go. Let's see how these guys are doing. All right, they're all, everybody's still instantly killed and we're on wave 70. So that's very nice. Looks like we're chilling. All right. We don't even have to set up our Gojos yet, which is nice. All right, I think it's time for us to turn off the attack effects so we can start, you know, honing in a little bit. 
and because I believe it's time for us to set up our Gojo soon. Oh, actually, no, everybody's getting instantly yeeted. Wow, Wave 72 is so easy. Let's get it, man. All right, let's check out the price. Who should we get another Tanjiro? I don't know, man. I don't really think it's necessarily worth it to get another Tanjiro. Hmm, I'm thinking actually it might be to have one Tanjiro on first. The question is, do we upgrade Guts more or get another Tanjiro on first? I think we're going to get another Tanjiro on first, but we're going to like move it over here so it doesn't like interfere at all. And we'll get it to like this upgrade so it's doing about like 3 to 4 million damage. Yeah, that should be nice. So this guy will hit everybody first and then this guy will hit everybody for the second time. So not bad. Actually, let's get a couple more upgrades on this Tanjiro because I'd rather have him be like AoE Cone because uh, I hate any AoE Circle units. And check our damage, guys. It is skyrocketing right now. Look at that. That's what we're talking about. We're not even on the last wave yet either. Dang, man. Dang. All right. I think we might get this guy to Twin Dragon Fury. Ooh, I just realized he's not really hitting over here. And he'll kind of hit over there. I probably put him in a slightly bad spot. But uh, it is what it is. So, hmm. Do we want to get Guts upgrade or this upgrade? Wait, what the heck? I'm paying 300k for only five. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. This, guy, this guy's upgrade is actually way more worth it. 800k for 1 million and better AOE or like 300k for like almost no increase at all. Yeah, that's uh, definitely not worth it. Yeah, we'll get this guy first and then focus on guts. All right, here we go. Let's get it. Bang. There we go. Now we're chilling. All right, time for us to get our guts some love though. <laughs> I really wanted to max him out, but dang, he's so expensive. We're only like halfway there and these are the cheap upgrades too, but we did make it to wave 82 so far. And, uh, yeah, it might be time for us to get Gojo soon, but not not quite. I think we could wait a little bit longer on those guys. All right, here we go. Get our next Guts upgrade. There we go. Oh, my gosh. He's doing 500,000 for each. That's not terrible, actually. It's not great, though. I just wish he had, like, Rupture by now. He would be so OP if that was the case, though. Right, I guess we have to keep saving up our money, guys. Ooh, is it time for us to do Gojos yet? I feel like it is. All right, we'll do our first Gojo. All right, just click auto, wait for the time stop to wear off, and bang. Wait for the time stop to wear off on all the enemies. Bang. All right, wait for the time stop to wear off on all the enemies, and oh wait, it didn't. Oh man, they all, they all just died. Bro, they all just died again. Bro. There we go, perfect. I think we got that one decent enough. It's not it's not perfect, but it's, it's pretty good for the time stops for what it is. It's not bad A little bit not perfect though. All right, let's get the next upgrade bang All right, we get another one as well for 600k this time. Oh my gosh Come on guts. We need you to step it up man Dang, I, I mean 4 million DPS is still good Especially considering how cheap he is, but uh, that AOE is not good at all. All right, dang though, our damage. We're already up to 103 billion damage. A hundred, we're only on wave 89. We haven't even nuked yet either. That's crazy. Dang, some of these guys are getting kind of far though. Yeah, we might have to nuke fairly soon. Oof, oof. It's gonna be a little bit sketchier. Yeah, they have like 100 million HP each. That's crazy. All right, Guts, man, it, it's up to you, my boy. It's up to you, man. You got this. You got this bang black beast. Oh, no, we need this upgrade I think it makes this AOE giant, but it's gonna cost us a million dollars So we're gonna have to wait till like wave 96 to be able to even afford that. I mean, we'll get there It just might be a little bit too late. This is looking a little bit sketchy here. All right I think it's time for us to set up our next Gojo here All right, actually, no, we need to figure out where the Gojo's like stop the Gojo stop actually stop right over here So I think we can just get the next guy up here There we go all right, and I guess we'll just preset up the next one as well. Here we go. All right, looks like we're not doing too bad though. I'm not really worried about 80, 50 million. Here we go. So, replace, bang. All right, get this one popping off. There we go. Sell, replace, <laughs> get the time stop on lock. Nah, our time stop are mid right now, dang. Dang, it's hard. It's hard to keep up with time stops on on the like a uh, full speed Very very hard to keep up with them. I Don't think we have to worry too much about it though, but uh, we just need like one more wave I think and uh, That will be beat us our last record, which is great and we haven't even used our nuke yet, which is even more great 
All right, there we go. We're almost to a billion, I mean a million as well that help out with guts a lot. So that's big. There we go, and there we go. All right, we just have to upgrade as fast as possible. I mean, it's almost, yeah, now nah, we're missing out a lot of time. All right, we can get this guts upgraded though. Black Beast, oh no, it didn't make his AOE that much bigger. That's unfortunate. Oh well, it is what it is. All right, looks like they're still getting time stop again. So that's good. We're up to a really high damage and a really high wave as well, which is big, massive. All right, we're gonna switch it to 1X now. Uh, Cause I think we're gonna need to, just cause uh, we have to get our timing perfect on everything now. So wait for these guys to wear off and bang there we go upgrade again yeah it's a really easy to time stop on 1x it's really hard to time stop on 3x all right and plus we need to get everything perfect perfect all right there we go wave 100 gotta get the nuke at the right time bang there we go still wave 100 Damage is a little bit, it's climbing up slower because we're not on 3x, but we're still over 200 billion damage, guys. That is wild, man. Look at that. We haven't even used our nuke yet. All right, we can get one time stop. Off. Actually, wait, they're dying. Ooh. Yeah, we might be able to squeeze this a little more than I want. There we go. Actually, you know what? We're just going to use the nuke before it's too late. Bang! Nuke. Oh, no, I forgot about that. That was dumb. Oh, man, I forgot about the cloner. Dang, that's unfortunate. Wave 101, guys. We died to a cloner. That is very unfortunate, but it is what it is, guys. Wave 101, so we beat our last record, but unfortunately, we died to a cloner. That's very unfortunate, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode, and we almost reached uh, 1 trillion damage. Also, check out this next video on the screen. I know you'll love it.